Hello everybody, I'm Bola from Veli Capelli. I'm here at Hasmid and today with uh, our patient, Dr. Corral Dogan. <laughs> How are you, doctor? Thank you for letting us. Thank you, I'm a little bit excited. Yeah. Because I will share my result for the first time. Yeah, it was, you were a patient, you had 1,900 graft yes. with uh, average gra uh, air per graft of 2.1, right? Exactly. It was exactly. almost seven months ago. Exactly, doctor, you remember everything. Yeah, I have good <laughs> memory. So, Dr. Koray, how was your experience at Tazmed? Are well, you happy with the results so far? In general, yes, I'm happy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm upset that I couldn't update my result, because I know people are asking me. But in the, in the beginning, I was very motivated, then I'm updating yeah. everyone, then I forgot to do that. <laughs> so you are <laughs> a people, bad patient. <laughs> people start to ask me and yeah. ask you an update. And now when I see you here, I think it's the perfect time to update everything so, with, an, with an expert like you. Thank you. So <laughs> how was the process? When did you start to see the first improvement? Yeah. I think everybody is asking about the pain, but pain mm -hmm. is not a, a big, big deal. I, I didn't feel any pain. The problem, only, only problem after the operation is the first night and the yeah. next night, because uh, you are trying to protect your grafts and uh, there is a stupid pillow that you have to use and then it's not easy to sleep with that. So I think the hardest part of operation is uh, sleeping part. <laughs> ah, okay. No pain, I didn't take any painkiller. People are exaggerating this type of things. Yeah. Maybe here with the anesthesiologist, I feel better because they, they are giving a little, little sedation during the surgery, so you don't really feel anything. Uh, and you have to wait. Yeah, After so that, when did you start to see the first I think movement, let's say? two months. Two At months, so two early. Months. Yeah, nearly. Uh, some of them didn't fall. Mm -hmm. Oh, so uh, they start growing? I think 50-50 as I remember, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, after two months they started to get a little bit more dense. It was a redness in the first month, yeah. uh, but in general, after two months I started to see something, but after four months, five months, it's getting more natural looking. Yeah. In the sixth month, uh, fifth month, as in the first, when they are growing the first time, they are getting thicker and looking a little bit less natural in the sixth month, but okay. after seven months, eight months, they are getting slightly adapting themselves to the area yeah. and they look more natural. I think these are the points. So you have still have five months of improvement, more or less. Yeah. 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 yeah and exactly. what about the donor area? Donor here do you do area. manual extraction? And yeah, I one. can see here is pretty perfect. I can see any, any sign of the extraction. No. 1,900 is it's not that not, much. Not like, the people are, sometimes they're asking me why you are using these too many systems to mm -hmm. make a coverage value and homogenization. Yeah, for 2,005, maybe 3,000, it doesn't matter too much. Without any calculation, uh, nearly everybody, they can extract 3,000, but yeah. it's, a, it's a process because hair loss is processing. So you need more graft in the future. So you have to calculate everything for the future hair loss. That's the point. So that if, for example, I have many cases, more than 10,000 graft, for th this type of cases, you have to make very good calculations. For, yeah, for 2,000 sure. graft, you don't have to calculate anything. Okay. <laughs> well, this, this patient is very well informed, I can yes. see. <laughs> so are you following any kind of therapy to keep your yeah, I did two times PRP treatment mm -hmm. after the surgery. Yeah, so you uh, think did this, this month, helped? Yeah, yeah it, uh, for the redness also it helps. Mm -hmm. And I'm under medication, finasteride. Okay. Uh, nothing else. Perfect. Good. Uh, not every case PRP is necessary, but I think it helps for the skin. Okay. Well, you can uh, see can the can, result. Yeah, sh yes, please. We can can you show your result to our patient? <laughs> I'm not going to comb you because <laughs> I still have some respect, but uh, we can, you can see the result. It's very natural. I'm yeah, seeing it from very close. I can share and, with uh, the camera. Only so single can... in the first millimeter of the airline, yeah, yeah, which yeah. is very important. This nice is, density. Yeah, this is looking nice. I'm, I'm giving a shape like this. Uh, this I'm using this shape and they can look closer. Yeah. 
So it looks and very the good and the donor area is... I don't have a very nice. good shape of my head, but <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy with the result. Well, okay, thank you to thank our you patient Mola. today. Thank you for doing this. Thank and you uh, as you can see, at Tazmed you can have this kind of result. <laughs> Natural and death. Thank, thank you, you, Dr. Correct. <laughs>